Hello, today we're going to take a look at using the DLL edition of Dibeno Quick PDF Library. Let's start by creating a new C Sharp project in Visual Studio. The project type doesn't matter, but for this tutorial we use a Windows Forms application. A C Sharp import file for the DLL edition is provided to make accessing the functions of the library easier. Add the C Sharp import file to your project. There is a 32 bit and a 64 bit version of the DLL edition, but for this demo we'll only use the 32 bit version. You have three options for where to store the DLLs. You can hard code a path to them on your machine. You can put them in the System32 folder, or you can keep them in the same folder as your, as your application's executable. We recommend keeping them in the same folder as your application's executable, because this is the safest option. Now let's add some code. Double click on the form, add the Debeno Quick PDF Library namespace to the users section. This is referencing the C Sharp import file that we've added to the project. It's up to you where you initialize the library, but for the purposes of this demo, we'll add it to the public partial class so that it's easily accessible from the rest of our code. When the form loads, we'll unlock the library. You can get your trial license key from the program files Debenu PDF library folder, or you can use your commercial license key if you've already purchased a license. Check the returns result for the library to see if it was unlocked successfully. This is an important step in debugging any issues you experience with the library. Now the library has been unlocked, let's create a new PDF. When Debeno Quick PDF Library is initialized, a blank document is created in memory and automatically selected, so you can, ask, you can start adding content straight away. You can create additional new documents by calling the new document function. Let's add some text to our new PDF, saved and then compile the application for the first time. As you can see, a new PDF has been created with the Hello World text. The Benny Quick PDF Library does a lot more than just create PDF files. You can also modify existing PDF files. Let's add a button to our form and add some code to the button which will rotate a page in our PDF by 90 degrees. As you can see, the page has been rotated by 90 degrees, and it only took three lines of simple code. That's it. Visit www.debenu.com and get in touch if you have any follow-up questions.